My name is Luca and I'm an industrial design student from OCAD and I'll be working at the Tro space at TroTech and I'll be showing you guys how to make all these chandeliers. For this project I ended up using three different types of wood, birch, maple and bamboo. They're all three millimeters thick. For the inner rings, I ended up using tro glass clear acrylic. The advantage of using a Trotec laser is that it makes everything more precise and it really, really is efficient. I do a lot of woodwork stuff at my school. And everything is done on the bandsaw, which is very manual and it's very time consuming and you don't really get the accuracy. By being able to produce a digital file, just throw it into the machine and get it to cut it out for you, everything is perfect and fits together very seamlessly. The way everything here fit together is I ended up doing a lot of test pieces and I based everything on certain tolerances. So I wanted to be able to fit everything without the use of glue. So anybody who cut this didn't have to use a lot of appliances. So a lot of it is test fitted. So I do give you uh, the specific tolerances for the specific amount of material. So like the birch and the acrylic have a different tolerance. The bamboo and the acrylic have a different tolerance and the maple and the acrylic have a different tolerance. The reason I ended up designing chandeliers is because I am an industrial design student and I like doing product design so I thought it would be a good challenge to try to design a chandelier and if you're looking at the random shapes I created, uh, this one was inspired by the Green Lantern. This one was just inspired by a traditional chandelier, I wanted to recreate it. And then this one was inspired by the Egyptian pyramids. Thank you for watching. I hope you liked this tutorial on how to make all these chandeliers. If you did like the work I did here, please click the link in the description below and that will lead you to my portfolio.